us close eyes abhi abhi as vahagamu offer yourself and your families to jesus today obe jeevitaya tobe paulat ada jesu to oppu karanna this is the month of june me june maase ai during the month of june we pray for our families to the sacred heart of jesus me maase tole api ape paul wenu wen jesu ge shri hardayata adinawa jesus is heart is filled with love jesu ge hadavata aadaren pirilai thiyenne from his heart blood and water flowed out unwahase ge hadavatin rudireyai jalayai galaginawa that blood and water indicated the love that is flowing forth from his heart e rudireyai jalayai sanketavat kale unwahase ge hadavatin galana aadareyai that love is for you and for your family e aadare obat obe paulat wenu wenui so for your family today enisa adu obe paul bar karanna let the lord bless your families swami dwahase ida den obe paul sparsha kala ashirwada karanna all the struggles that our families are going through ape paul gaman karana hama aragalayakma all the pain that our families are going through ape paul gaman karana hama vedana vakma all sicknesses that our family members are going through ape paul samajikyo aragala karana hama rogyakma let us pray that god in his mercy will bring healing upon them today ape yadimu swamin vahanse ge dayava tula unvahanse on veta suvaya ginenu pinissa let us pray for one another ape ekinika venuven yadimu especially those who have come here with sicknesses visheshin metanata rogi tatvati age napu aya those who have come with a desire to be touched and healed sparshak labala suvenna kemattha kin napu aya let us pray that jesus touches them today api ademu ada jesu onva sparsha karanu labannata that jesus heals even the most intense of sicknesses jesu da puluwan itama darunu roga pavasuwa karanna pray for the lord's healing touch swami in vahanse ke suve sparshe udesaya adinna as we take a reading from the letter of saint james chapter 5 verses chapter 5 verses 13 to 16 jacob tumage pote pasweni parichede 13 weni vaganti sita oba atarin yamak yamek duk vidinne nam oh yaksha kereva yamek preetien sitinne nam oh tutigi gayava ඔබ අතරින් යමෙක් රෝගීව සිටින්නේ නම් ඔහු සභා මූලිකයන් කැඳවා ගනීවා ඒ මූලිකයෝ සමිදානන් වහන්සේගේ නාමයෙන් ඔහු තෙලින් ආලේප කොට ඔහු දෙසා යාක්ෂා කරත්වා එවිට ඇදහිල්ලෙන් පුදන යාක්ෂාවෙන් රෝගියාට සුවය ලැබේ සමිදානන් වහන්සේ ඔහු නැකිටු වනු ඇත ඔහු පව් කර තිබේ නම් ඒ පව් ඔහුට කමා කරනු ලැබේ එබැවින් ඔබ එකිනෙකාට පාපොච්චාරණය කළ කර සුවය ලබන පිණිස එකිනෙකා උදෙසා යාක්ෂා කරන්න දැහැමි මිනිසෙකු යදින යදුම බලවත්ය ඵලදායකය the the word of the lord swamin vahanseege suvisheshe meseya thanks be to god kindly be seated hallelujah 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 good morning dear friends subha udasana kvitura mitruyeni how are you obata kohomada are you keeping well praise the lord praise the lord how many of you are coming here for the first time to divine can you raise your hands divine yana kanti madhyasana da palaveni vatawata enaya podda katha usan most welcome to the divine retreat center oba hama kenekoma api bohoma adaren piligannawa it is a blessing to pray with you oba tekka yadinnata labi ma aashirwadayak and we hope and pray today the lord will touch you and all those intentions you have come here with api viswasa karanawa yadinawa oba va swamin vahanse ada sparsha karavi kiyala oba metan tapu hama illimakma unwase pilituru devi kiyala and all those of you who come here regularly 
නිරන්තරයෙන් අපිට අපිත් එක්ක සම්බන්ධ වෙන අයත් you know you always welcome ඔබ දන්න ඔබ අපි හැම තිස්සෙම ආදරයෙන් පිළිගන්න බව it is always a blessing praying with the community හැම තිස්සෙම සංඝයක් එක්ක යාක්ෂා කරන්නට ලැබීම ආශිර්වාදයක් today is a friday අද සිකුරාද දවසක් and yet so many of you have come නමුත් ඔබෙන් ගොඩක් අය ඇවිල්ලා ඉන්නවා and today we pray specifically for the lord to heal our physical ailments eni sada api vishesha karayen yadinnata ena swamin vahanseke sparshe illala ape sharirika rogi tatvyan suvage sandaha sickness is something that we don't like rogya kiyanne api kemathi nathi deyak sickness is often something we are afraid of rogya kiyanne godak kalawata api baya wena deyak whichever sickness we get we pray that we get healed from it mona rogayak apita hadunat api yaaksha karana api eken suwa wei kiyala whatever sickness we don't have apita nathi monama rogayak unath when we are suffering with our own sickness api ape apema ledak ekka aragala karana kota vedana vidina kota we tell jesus api jesu da kiyenawa lord jesus heal this sickness jesus swamini me rogaya suwa karanna any other sickness is okay වෙන ඕනම ලෙඩක් ප්‍රශ්නයක් නැහැ this sickness is too much මේ ලෙඩේ නම් ගොඩක් වැඩි so if i have diabetes මට දිය වැඩියව තියෙනවා නම් i will tell the lord මම ස්වාමින් වහන්සේට කියන්න යනවා jesus i like sweets very much ජේසුනි මම පැණි රස කෑම වලට ගොඩක් කැමති any other sickness is okay වෙන ඕනම ලෙඩක් මට දෙන්න but take out diabetes නමුත් දිය වැඩියව අයින් කරන්න then jesus will say එවිට ජේසු ඔබට කියාවි well michael you asked hari michael obe huwa to have any other sickness wen ona ma ledak denna kiyala so here i give you a heart problem daman obata harada rogayak denawa and i will take away your diabetes man obe diya wadiya oben ayin karanna and then two days into the heart problem ida passe dawas dekak harada rogaye indala i will tell the lord man nawatha jesu da kiyanne yanawa lord anything else but a heart problem swami ni wen ona rogayak harada rogaye nathuwa then the lord might say okay maybe a back problem hari swami na sevita kai hari ema na konde amaruwak and then we will think lord anything else but the back problem ida passe api edana swami ni wena ona leda konde amaru nathu kiyala praise the lord praise the lord every sickness every ailment has its own pain and suffering hamma rogayakma ekatama vishesha vecha vedanawak dukindimak ekkai enne so we cannot say looking at someone else that they are suffering less than us enisa apita kenek diha balla kiyanna ba e kena apita wada adu wenawi vedana widinne kiyala or that that sickness is better than this ema natan ara rogi tatte mage rogi tatte wada hondai kiyala all sicknesses obviously disturb us hamma rogi tatteyakma hama tissima apita karadareta pat karana and that is why why we pray for healing eni sa thamai api suwe udesa yadinne it disturbs our body ek ape sharireta karadara karanawa it disturbs our day to day life ek ape dainika jeevitayata karadara karanawa it disturbs how we do things api dewal karana vidiyata eka karadarayak karanawa it disturbs what we can do apita karanna puluwan de karadareta pat karanawa as you're growing older oba wedi mahalu wena kota as we are growing older api okkoma wedi mahalu wena kota not only you even i am growing old oba vitarak newe math vayasata yana even he is growing old mama math vayasata yana kila piyuthuma kiyana did he translate that correctly <laughs> hallelujah 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 so like someone said eni sa kene kiwa wage every second we live api jeevathara hama tapparayakama is every second we are dying අපි මැරෙන තප්පරයක් වෙනවා every second we live අපි ජීවත් වෙන හැම තප්පරයක්ම is every second us dying අපි මැරෙමින් ඉන්න තප්පරේ ගොත් වෙනවා so if i'm living today මම අද ජීවත් වෙනවා නම් there's one day less from what i have to live මට ජීවත් වෙන්න තියෙන කාලෙන් එක දවසක් තව අඩු වෙනවා and so in spite of knowing these things මේ දේවල් දැන ගැනීම තුලත් sicknesses disturb us roge apiwa karadareta pat karana because we would like to do the things we always did before mokada api hama tissama kamadi api kalin karanna purudu vecha dewal nawata karanna i love sports mama kreeda karanna kamadi but i've got a back problem i've got knee problems namuth mata konde amaruwak thiyena danishya amaruwak thiyena i would love to play like i played when i was 20 mama kemathi man avurdu 20 krida kala wage danath krida karan even when i'm playing i think like i'm 20 mama dangsel lankaraddit man hitanne mata avurdu 20 ay kiyala 
but in 5 minutes my body reminds me that i'm 47 namut vinadi pahaking mata mage sharire matak karana mata avurudu 47 kiyala so i cannot do the things i could do before ene sa kalin karanna puluwan dewal dam mata karanna ba that is why sickness disturbs us e vidiyata thamai rogi tattwayan api o karadareta pat karanni because there were so many things we could do before now we are not able to do it mokada apita kalin karanna puluwan wecha dewal godak thiyena dan apita karanna bari so it is very natural to pray that we are healed enisa bohoma swabhavika deyak thamai api suwaya vedi enu yaaksha karana eka there's nothing wrong in that eke kisima varaddak ne but we remind ourselves enisa api apitoma matak karaganna one that it is the lord who decides what healing we need swamin vahase thamai thirne karanne mona vidiye suwayak da apita awashya kiyala it is the lord who decides if we should be healed or no swamin vahase තීරණය කරන්නේ අපි සුව වෙන්න ඕනේද නැද්ද කියලා. The Lord never made any promise to us that we will live forever. ස්වාමින් වහන්සේ අපිට කිසිම පොරොන්දුවක් දීලා නැහැ අපි සදා කාලෙටම ජීවත් වෙනවා කියලා. I'm sure Jesus did not come to you in a dream and tell you you know you will live forever. මම මට විශ්වාසයි ජේසුව ඔබේ නින්දෙන් ඔබට සිහිනේකෙන් ඇවිල්ලා ඔබට කිව්වේ නැහැ ඔබ මැරෙන්නේ නැතුව හැමදාම ජීවත් වෙන්න යනවා කියලා. That you will be young forever. ඔබ සදා කාලෙටම තරුණ වෙලා ඉන්න යනවා කියලා. No. that promise was never given na e porondu kavada wad dunne na that he hasn't even given us a promise that we will be healed unwahase apita porondu ak wela ne apa suwa wei kiyala wad of every sickness and ailment apita labena hama roge ekin apa suwa wei kiyala he hasn't given us a promise that we will live forever unwahase apita porondu ak dilane api meren nathu jeevat wenawa kiyala but he has permitted us to pray for whatever we want to pray for namo tunwahase apita ida dila tinawa yaaksha karanna apita yaaksha karanna awashyaya kela thiyena hitena ona ma deyak wenuwen hallelujah hallelujah so we have the right to pray enisa apita aithiyak thiyena yaaksha karanna for the lord to touch and heal so amen wahase da sparsha kala suwa karanna kiyala in whichever way he knows is best for us unwahase danna apita hondai kiyala unwahase da hitena ona ma vidiyakin because all of us have sicknesses mokada api hamota ma rogi tattwayan thiyena in some way or the other eka vidiyakin hari wenat vidiyakin hari you are physically sick oben samaharak sharirika rogi vela inno how many of you have any kind of sickness can you raise your hands oben ki denekta rogi tattwayak thiyena oda obata athawusanna puluwanda you have only half sickness raise only half hands bagata leda aya bagata athawusanna if you have full sickness raise full hands if you have multiple sicknesses you can raise both but rogi tattwa godak thiyena na addeka musan if you have more than 5 6 you can raise legs and everything rogi tattwayan pagata hayakata adi denna kakula thussan that is how some of us are some of us have lots of aches and pains api api aben samaharakta godak vedanawan thiyena a person once came to me and said eka wathawak manushek mata avilla kiwwa man elderly lady vayasaka kantawa she came and told me father please lay your hands on my head i get headaches very often ඒ මට කිව්වා ස්වාමිනි පීතුමනි ඔබතුමා මගේ හිසට අත තියලා යාක්ෂා කරන්න ගොඩක් වෙලාවට මට ඔළුවෙ කැක්කුම හැදෙනවා කියලා so i placed my hands on her and i prayed intensely i prayed and i prayed took some time and i prayed මං ඇයගේ හිස මත අත තියලා යම් වෙලාවක් අරගෙන බොහොම දැඩිව යාක්ෂා කළා and after i finished that prayer i said thank you auntie i'll continue to pray for you මං ඇයට යාක්ෂා විවර කළා කිව්වා සූති auntie මං ඔබට දිගින් දිගටම යාක්ෂා කරන්න කියලා then she showed me her left shoulder and said father pray put your hand here also and pray ंड <laughs> ඊට පස්සේ ඇය මගේ උකුල පෙන්නන කොහොමද පියතුමනි මෙතනත් ලෙඩක් තියෙනවා so in that final prayer when i was praying i said all the pain in the body the leg pain the hand pain the back pain all the pains jesus bless and heal ඒ නිසා ඒ විදිහට මම කරපු ඇයට අන්තිමට කරපු යාච්චාය මම ඇයට කිව්වා ඇයගේ තියෙන හැම රෝගී තත්වයම දනිස්සේ උකුලේ කොන්දේ හැම රෝගී තත්වයක්ම jesus ස්පර්ශ කළ සුව කරන්න කියලා and i was so happy thinking that i outsmarted her මම විතක්ෂ නුනා ඇයට වඩා කියලා මම සන්තෝෂ වුණා ඊට පස්සේ because i put all the sicknesses into one මොකද මම ඔක්කොම ලෙඩ එක යාක්ෂාවකට දාලා යාක්ෂා කළා and then i told her auntie i will pray for you ඊට පස්සේ මම ඇයට කිව්වා auntie මම ඔබට වෙන ඉන්නවා තව යාක්ෂා කරන්නම් කියලා and she told me father you forgot i have got heart problem can you pray for that also ඊට පස්සේ ඇයි කෝ පිටුමනි ඔබලා අමතක වුණා මට හෘද රෝගයකුත් තියෙනවා ඒ වෙනුවෙන් උනුත් යාක්ෂා කරන්න කියලා so maybe we have multiple problems සමහර වෙලාවට අපිට බහුල ප්‍රශ්න තියෙන්න පුළුවන් we have multiple sicknesses අපිට ගොඩක් ලෙඩ රෝග තියෙන්න පුළුවන් and we pray for it අපි ඒ වෙනුවෙන් යදිනවා 
we have a right to pray apida aithiyak thiyena oya dinna because we are praying to our lord and savior mokada api yadinne ape swamin saha galom karyanante so we ask jesus to touch and to heal enisa api jesu da kiyena sparsha kala su karanna kiyala so during this day we will go through different sessions knowing how we prepare ourselves for the last final adoration Enis- for the lord's healing touch enisa ada davase me deshanayan tula api igana gannata yana vividha karayen kohomada api avasarane di unwahasege sparshata sa suweta sudana wenno ne kiyala what i will speak to you about man obata katha karannata yana and i want you to know and realize oba danagena avabodha karaga ඕන දේ තමයි is how powerful a prayers can be අපේ යක්ෂව කොයි තරම් බලගතු ඉද කියන එක that prayer in itself යක්ෂවම is a very powerful and a very intimate act ගොඩක් බලගතු ලෙන්ගතු ක්‍රියාවක් it is a very powerful and a very intimate act බලගතු සහ ලෙන්ගතු ක්‍රියාවක් why do i say it is powerful that i'll come to and why do i say it's an intimate act මම ඇයි ඒක මම බලගතු කියපු එකට නැවත එන්න ඇයි මම ලෙන්ගතු ක්‍රියාවක් කියලා යක්ෂව හැඳින්වුවේ when a husband a man and woman get married පුරුෂයෙක් සහ ස්ත්‍රියක් විවාහ වුණාම they have physical and emotional intimacy ශාරීරික සහ හැඟීම් වලින් ඔවුන් අතර ලෙන්ගතුකමක් ඇති වෙන්නට යනවා they become one with each other ඔවුන් එකිනෙක සමග එක්කෙනෙක් වෙන්නට යනවා and from there comes both comes forth the fruits of that intimacy එතනින් පස්සේ තමයි ඒ ලෙන්ගතුකමේ ඵල එළියට එන්නට යන්නේ they are intimate with each other ඔවුන් එකිනෙකාට ලෙන්ගතුයි physically and emotionally ශාරීරිකව සහ හැඟීම් බරව prayer is an intimate moment with god යක්ෂව කියන්නේ දෙවියන් එක්ක ලෙන්ගතු වෙන මොහොතක් prayer is not just certain moments of uttering things yaksha vakyanne api vachana ucharane karana mohotak neme prayer is not just coming and taking a book and just reading and feeling good that i've said a prayer yaksha vakyanne potak karagena avilla eka perala eka thiyena deyak kiyala mama yaksha karai kiyala hondai kiyala hitena tanak neme we have to understand that prayer is an intimate moment with god api avobodha karaganata avasha yaksha vakyanne deviyan ekka lengathu mohotak kiyala i connect to god in prayer mama deviyanta sambandha wenawa yaksha avathula i'm open to god in prayer man deviyanta vyurtha wenawa yaksha avathula I lose myself to God in prayer. මම මගේ ස්වභාවය නැති කරගන්නවා දෙවියන් තුල යක්ෂාව ඇතුලේ. So often we think that prayer means I have to finish a set of set of words or sentences. ගොඩක් වෙලාවට අපි යක්ෂාව කියලා හිතන්නේ මම යම් වගන්ති ප්‍රමාණයක් කියවලා ඉවර කරන්න ඕනේ කොටසක් විදියට. When I was young, මම තරුණයෙක් විදිහට ඉන්නකොට when I was younger when i was younger not young i'm young now also but ye tuma denut tarunai meeta wada taruna winna kota hallelujah hallelujah so when i was younger and i was at home mama gedara hitiye we would have family prayers api paule yaksha vela wak tibba my father would be the one who would call the family and say come let us pray mage tata thamai paule ata katha karanne paule yaksha wata it was so boring eka godak kammeli sagata deyak we had to go and sit and we'd say the rosary api gihilla indagena japa male kiyanno ni and i'd be waiting to see when it'll get over mam balagena indike koi velawe divara wenne kiyala you feel the same obata thehema ma dannawa neda yeah sometimes you're just waiting when it'll get over <laughs> and we are just saying things api deval kiyanawa sometimes family prayer i don't know if it happens over here in my land very often i've heard it man thana mehe wenawada kiyala mage bhoomi mage rate man godak welawata meka ahala thiyena i come from kerala in india mama india ave kerala walin thama inne most of the christian families will have family prayer goda kithunu paul paule yaksha wak karanawa but sometimes it's very amusing to hear that godak welawata eka bohom puduma sagathai meka ahana ekak because when we come for that family prayer then api me paule yaksha wata ena welawe di we have to make the family prayer every day hama daw api aniwaren paule yaksha wata karanna mone but when we come for the family prayer namuth api paule yaksha wata ena welawe di sometimes it turns out only like words samahara welawata eka wachana walin pamanak piricha deyak wenawa because we think of so many other things during the family prayer mokada e paule yaksha welawa athule api godak dewal gena wena dewal gena hitana it is a wonderful time for dreaming ඒක හි සිහින දකින්න හොඳ වෙලාවක්. When I used to be younger, මම තරුණයෙක් වෙලා ඉන්නකොට and we had family prayer. අපිට පෞලේ යක්ෂව තියෙන වෙලාවේ I used to think when I was saying hail mary I used to think about the bikes that I might drive one day. නමෝ මරිය කියන වෙලාවේ මම පුරුදු වෙලා හිටියා මම කවද හරි දවසක පදී කියලා මම හිහින දැකපු මෝටර් බයිසිකල් ගැන හිතන්න. It was not bicycle man motor bikes. Motor bicycle. Or bicycle. Bicycle you drive. 
motorbikes, you know, all these 250 cc's, 500 cc, that kind of bikes, bike spikes. Yaturupedi. So that is what you dream of. You don't have to dream about driving a cycle that anybody can do. So during that prayer time, it's a wonderful time to dream. So you can do multiple time, multiple things during the prayer. You can dream. You can plan of men plan for many things and at the end of the prayer you can feel nice that you said the prayer also. In English we call that multitasking. That is why even our parents do that. When they are sitting for prayer they'll say hail Mary full of grace see that light is on go switch it off and come <laughs> till that time the light was on before the prayer they didn't switch it off but when during prayer time now light is on sometimes hail Mary full of grace did the pressure cooker noise come is the gas off? Gas cooker. All that multitasking happens during prayer time. And at the end of the prayer, we are very happy because we said the prayer also. But is that actually prayer? That is the question we need to ask ourselves. Most of us are people who pray or we are thinking that we prayed. So recently we were going, I think it was to Valavata for the uh, for the first Thursday service. So myself, Father Joby, uh, you know Father Joby, he's the assistant director, he's here. Mama Joby Petumatgiya. And uh, Jerry and Romy were there. Jerry, Romy, Thitya. And we were driving. Now, Father Joby sings very well. You should ask him to sing some Sinhala songs. He sings very well. <laughs> so, he sings very well. And usually, when he's driving, he'll start singing Malayalam songs. So, he was driving and singing Malayalam songs. And then, with his hand, he was doing conducting, you know. Singing and he's doing conducting. One hand was on the steering wheel. And in the other hand, uh, uh, that nicely he was doing with his hand. So I asked him, if I move my hand also, will my voice sound the same? I told him, when I sing and I move the hand, the, the, it doesn't sound very good. So he told me, that is because you think you are singing, you are only saying things. <laughs> That is how many of us are. If you put earphones and you sing, you will think you are singing very well. But you are only saying things. That is what he was telling me. That is how it is with prayer. We think we are praying. But prayer is not actually happening. Prayer is not just about saying a few words. Prayer is when I become intimate with God. And becoming one with God. I'm connecting to God. I am letting myself be controlled by God. Then when the words come out, those words become powerful. 
వచన బలగతు వెన్నట యనవా బికాజ్ నౌ ఐ యామ్ ఇంటిమేట్ విత్ గాడ్ మొకద మమ దన్ దేవియన్ ఎక్క లింగతుయి హల్లెలూయా హల్లెలూయా ఇన్ మాథ్యూ చాప్టర్ 6 వర్స్ 7 మాథ్యూ చాప్టర్ 6 వర్స్ 7 ద వర్డ్ సేస్ హై హత్తని వగంతియ when you pray do not heap up empty phrases as the gentiles do for they think that they will be heard for their many words tavada yaksha kirime de vichatin men digin digatama his vachana nododanna own dodana vachana rashi nisa deviyan wahanse ota kandenu atai ohu sitati when you pray don't just heap up many words oba yaksha karaddi nikan ohe vachana bahulaya kiya gena yanne pa and think that that will be okay in the presence of god so amin vahase ke wada siti mama de eka hari kela hitanne pa so sometimes we can say at least five rosaries samara velawata api ta japa male passwatawak kiyanna puluwan any of you say five rosaries in a day oba kiya denek dawasata japa male passwatawak yaksha karanawada some of you say more than five rosaries very good So you can say five rosaries obata puluwan japa male passata wak yaksha karanna but if your words are not in intimacy with god let me tell you it is waste of time namuth obe wachana deviyan ekka lengathu kamakin nemei nam eliyata enne mata kiyanne ida denna oba karanne kaale ka adamimak i can read the bible mata bible e kiyawanna puluwan but if i am not open to god namuth mama deviyan ta viwurtha nattang if i am not intimate with jesus man jesus ekka lengathu nattang this moment of prayer me yaksha ve velawa will not have any power kisima balayak denne yanne ne the power of prayer yaksha ve balaya is the moment of intimacy with god tamai deviyan ekka lengathu wi me mohota hallelujah 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 so the power of prayer is the moment of intimacy with god enisa yaksha ve balaya kiyanne deviyan ekka api lengathu wena mohotai at that time i'm connected to god e vela man deviyanta sambandha vela inne at that time i'm one with god e vela vida man deviyanne ek ekattayakata avilla inne so the words that come out enisa eliyata na vachana are not just a lot of words put together to satisfy my mind mage manasa strupti mat karagana nikan eliyata dana vachana godak nemei but rather it is words that are coming out from my intimate moment with jesus in my heart eka jesu i mage hadavata ekatina e lengathu mohata tulin neliyata galagena ena vachana wennata yanawa hallelujah hallelujah that is when prayer becomes powerful evita thamai yaakshawa balagathu wennata yanne hallelujah 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 are you awake oba harila dinne you should smile when you're sitting in god's presence devian ge wedasiti mada oba indagin inna koda oba hina vela innu are you sad oba dukhende inne are you happy santoshende inne are you getting nice sleep honda ninda kopata dang wati gena yanawada i don't want to disturb your sleep oba nindara karadara karanna wata onne if you're getting nice sleep please continue sleeping oba honda ninda kata oba wati gena yanawa nan karadara kala digara onne ida gan because i understand that is also one of the healings mokada mama therun aran thiyena ekat ek vidika soyak kiyala so many people come they don't get sleep for many months masa ganak ninda nathu inna minissu wenawa and then they come here own metana dena ida passe and they listen to one session of father michael michael betuma ekka deshane ekata on sawan denawa and then they get healed evi don to suwe labena so if you know anybody who doesn't have sleep enisa oba nindak nathi kenek kawuru hari dannawa nam you should tell them there is one medicine in the divine retreat center outa kiyanne ekata behetak thiyena divine jnana kalthi madhyasthane kiyala he is in the form of father michael father michael kena swarupayen thamai e beheta thiyenne you just sit for one hour and definitely you will be at your sleep ekka payakata idagena inna anniwaryenna obata ninda labena kiya that is why whenever i see people sleeping during my session i thank jesus enisa thamai mage deshane thula man minissu nida gena inna kota man jesus stuthi kiyanne because i'm so happy they are getting healing moka donte suwe labema gena mana godak santoshai but then you should come and give your testimony also namuth oba avilla ekata saakshi darannat thoni ida pasu you should come and tell people you know i came here i wasn't getting sleep and father michael sessions are so nice to sleep oba minisun ta vela kiyanno ne man metana rena kota mata nindak tibbe na mata ninda ganna bari kenek widi riti namuth michael peetuma ge deshanawa thula mata hodara ninda giya kiyala don't worry i will not feel sad kana gaadu wenne ba man e gena duk wenne yanne i feel i will feel very happy man godak santosh wenawa e gena that you are getting sleep at least oba adu gane ninda hari labena kiyala if i'm disturbing your sleep that is not good man obe nindara karadara karana nan eka honda deyak nemi but you should be happy about everything namuth oba hama deyak gena santosha wenno hallelujah 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 so 
our prayers become powerful ape yakshavan balagathu wenni not because of the power with which we utter it api eka uchcharane karana balayak nisa nemei but because of the intimacy we have with jesus when we are praying it jesus te kapitena lengathu kama api e wachana uchcharane karaddi so the power in the prayer is not mine enisa yakshave balaya mage nemei the power in the prayer is jesus yakshave balaya jesui Hallelujah 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 so in all our prayers it is ape hama yaksha wak walama it becomes powerful ewa balagathu wennata yanne is when we are in union with jesus ape jesus tek ekatwayak tule inna when we are in intimacy with jesus ape jesus tek balengathu kamak tule inna kodai and then you utter those words evit obe wachana uchcharane karaddi that becomes powerful ewa balagathu wennata yanawa because of jesus is present mokada jesus ge weda sidima nisa not because of your power obe balayak nisa nemei hallelujah 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 Hallelujah. 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 The letter of St James chapter 5 verse 16. Jacob Jacob tumage pote passeri parichchede 16 weni wagantiya The prayer of a righteous person has great power as it is working. Dahame minisuku yadena yaduma balawatya paladayakaya. The prayer of a righteous person. Yahapat manushyege yakshava What is the quality of a righteous person? Yahapat manushyege lakshane mukakda? What is the main quality of a righteous person? Mukakda yahapat manushyege pradhana lakshane? Awake? Arila dinne? Sleeping? Nidida? Can you wake up 2 minutes? Answer and then go back to sleep. Bina di deka kar rakilla uttara dila nidagan. So what is the main characteristic of a righteous person? Enisa yahapat dahami manushyege pradhana gunaya lakshane mukakda? I don't know. Main quality of a righteous person. Dahami manushyege pradhana gunaya faith at the hill honesty avanka bhava humble humbleness humility behapat kama where does all that come from e hama deyak ma enni kohenda that comes from a relationship with god e siyal enne deviyan ekka dena sambandhaya thuli the main characteristic of a righteous person is that they are right with god dahame manushyege pradhanama gunaya thamai own deviyan ekka yahapat sambandha kamak inne so a person who is right with god deviyan ekka yahapat sambandha kamak inna puddha the letter of saint james says jacob jacob tumage lipi kina wage the prayer of a righteous person dahame puddgalege yakshava because they are right with god mokada own deviyan ekka yahapat sambandha kamak inna nisa that prayer has great power e yakshavata maha balayak thiyena where is that prayer coming from kohende yaksha wenni or where is that power coming from kohende bale enni that power is coming from god e bale enne deviyan gen because of that union with god mokada onta e deviyan ekata ne ekat wenisa hallelujah 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 that is what we should always know about our prayer eka thamai api ape yaksha wage hama disima danagena inna onade prayer is not about just saying a lot of things ape yaksha wage ne godak dewal kiyana deyak nemi our prayer is not even about just coming from us samara welawata ape yaksha wage ne pooja wata ne ekat nemi our prayer is not just about saying that rosary or saying 10 rosaries ape yaksha wage ne 10 watawak japa mala yaksha karaga nemi the prayer is a prayer when we are in intimate union with god and from there comes power yaksha wakyanne yaksha wak api deviyan ekka lengathu kamak inna kota balaya galagena ne yaksha wak mark chapter 11 verse 24 mark to mark chapter 11 verse 24 ekolosseri parichchede 24 i tell you whatever you ask in prayer believe that you have received it and it will be yours ebavein mama obata kiyemi oba yakshaven aydena khavara deyak kowada e obata labune ay adahanna evita e obata labenne emaya hallelujah hallelujah in john chapter 14 verse 14 joam 14 14 eni wagantiya if you ask for anything in my name i will do it oba mage namen aydena khavara deyak kowada mama itu karanne me if you ask for anything in My name I will do it. Oba mage name na idena kavara deyak kowada mama itu karanne. Hallelujah. 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 So when you're praying, eni sa oba yaksha karaddi, can you pray oba yaksha karanna puluwanda and say yaksha kala kiyanna puluwanda in the name of Father Michael I want healing. Michael peetu mage name en mata suwe oni kiyala. Can you do that? Oba tek karanna puluwanda. Uh, is Father Michael a nice priest? Michael peetu ma yahapat pooja kekkda honda ekkenekkda? you know who is father michael mother father michael can kawuda kasanna me me i'm father michael 
mantama michael beto so is father michael a nice priest michael beto ma yaha pat prasanna piyutum ekda say loudly ho hi enkiya that is what is said no what what do you say for yes oh oh no ho oh. say loudly <laughs> hallelujah hallelujah so father michael is a nice priest uh, michael beto ma prasanna piyutum ek father michael is a holy priest michael beto ma shuddhanta piyutum ek Say say yes for oh, everything. Yeah, no, yeah. <laughs> everything you have to say yes. Ama there no bahu kya no. There is no options for answers. Only one option is yes. Thora ke uttar denna ve. Ama prashna to bahu ki lagya. Hallelujah. 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 So I might be a holy priest. Ama shuddha vanta pe ek tu mekwe na puluan. I might be a kind priest. Ama karuna vanta pe tu mekwe na puluan. I might be a good priest. Ama yaha pat puja ke ekwe na puluan. But in your prayer, you cannot say in the name of Father Michael. I ask for the Lord. God's healing. Namo tobe yaksha vedi obata kenne baya Michael Petuma ge name in man swami nuwase gen suwe illena wa kiyala. Why? Ai. Because how much ever you know me, oba mawa koi taram danagena hitiyat, we don't share any intimacy. Api leggatu kamak beda ganne nahe. We don't become one. Api ekatwe ekata inne nahe. In our spirituality we don't become one. Api adhyatmikatwe tul api ekatwe ekata inne nahe. So nothing can come forth from me. It is a mage tulen no but enna kisi madiyak ne. But pray with Jesus. Namu Jesus te kagarne aksha. You are becoming one. Oba ekatwe ekata inna. That is why the scripture says. Eni sa tamai de vachane kiyanne. When you ask for anything in my name says the Lord you will receive it. Oba mage name na idena khavara deyak kohoda mam itu karami kiyala. When you become one with jesus oba jesus tek ekatwe ekata ena kota hallelujah 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 that is a powerful prayer eka balagathu yaakshawak wenna now that kind of a prayer you can use it for yourself dan e wage vidhi yaakshawak obata oba wenuwen pavichcha karannath puluwan but it becomes an even more powerful prayer when you use it for others e eetat wada balagathu yaakshawak wenawa oba e anitta wenuwen pavichcha karaddi because it becomes a selfless pray mokada eka tamangwa amataka karapu yaakshawak wena nisa how many of you want healing raise your hands oben ki denekta suwa yone data ussanna all those who want healing raise your hands suwaya ona ayata ussanna don't be lazy sometimes you are very lazy with half hands you will get only half healing don't complain afterwards kammali vela baage data ussanna ba obata baage ka suwayak labe ida passe passe giyanne ba full healings raise full hands Very good. Everyone wants healing. All sick people in Sri Lanka. Lanka in Okkuma leda hai. Kotha ho suwe ho. Hallelujah. 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 So you want healing. It is about a suwe ho ne. Now how many of you want your brother, your sister next to you to be healed also? Then noben ke dene ekto ne do beha pati no be sahodariya sahodariya to suwe akla ben. See what lovely people. Very nice. Koi thara adar ne mene suwe. Now suppose Jesus tells you. Then he thane Jesus bad ke na. Only one of you are going to get healed. Oben denna ging ek kenekta vitarai suwaya laben. Either you or the person next to you. Ekko oba ekko oba te habat tinne kena. Either you or the person next to you. Ekko oba ekko oba habat tinne kena. Now how many of you would want the person next to you to be healed but you will not get healed? Can you reason? Oben ki denek tone da anith kena ata suwaya laben habe e laben ti obata suwaya laben ne ne. Numbers are re- less anyway. Some are, some are very sadly raising their hands. Some are with tama kana gaatuenga to usse. Everyone else is raising, so I'll raise also. Hamo ma to usse na ni sam to usse. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How many of you are praying for your family members to be healed? Obe Paul le aya soe venu pini soben kiyene ki aksha karna wad. Very good. So now the person next to you might be a stranger. Uh, then oben eha patti indagene inne kena samala to oba aganthu ka kenek wenna puluwan and jesus tells you then jesus obata kena you can pray only for one person obata puluwan ek kenek wenuwen yadinna vitarai either that stranger e ekko e aganthu kiya or for your family member ehema natta obey paul e samajika kiya who will you pray for kauru wenuwen oba aksha karanne hallelujah 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 we like to direct prayers towards ourselves api kamati yaakshavan api kerehi yomu karagan we like to direct prayers towards our own loved ones ape ma adaraniyan wenuwen yaakshava yomu karagan api kamati anything connected to i i like to pray for mama kiyana kenata sambandha hama deyak wenuwen mama kamati yaaksha kara but the most selfless prayer namut vadaatma pararthakami yaakshava thamai and so the most powerful prayer And so the most powerful prayer e wage ma wadaatma balagathu yaakshava thamai is when our prayers are directed towards someone we don't even know ape yaakshava samalata api dannewath nathi kenek kerehi yomu ena welawa 
because in that there is no selfishness at all mokada e tula kisima aatmarthayak ne there is no i mama kiyana kena aitana ne my prayer my healing my family my child my husband my wife mage soya mage aakshava mage swami purusha mage birida mage paula kile kak ne lord i don't even know that person swami ni adugane mange kenawa danne wat ne but can you heal that person namuda obata puluwan de kenawa suwa karanna that prayer does not have any selfishness in it e aakshava ta kisima aatmarthayak ne that prayer does not have any conditions in it e aakshava ta kisima kondesiyak ne so i don't know my sister e nisa mammeta ninna mage sahodariwa danne ne i might have seen you before but i don't know samalar mang oba kalin dekala thiyena unda oba danne ne i know kavisha pituma maava danno kavisha ask me for prayers mam pituma gen yaksha karanna kela illena wa you ask me for prayers for marriage and all right no okay no what prayer then you want okay so he is asking for prayer for your family okay yes so prayers for his mother right prayers for your mother okay so we are uh, he asked for prayers for his mother mama pituma gen mage amma wenuwen yaksha karanna kela kiyena wa now you ask me for prayers for maybe your daughter or son the make na pituma gen yaksha villana wa age putha du wenuwen now i know kavisha more da pituma ma wada wadiyin danna wa so kavisha uh, and and because i know kavisha more i have a tendency to pray 10 minutes more for kavisha than i have time for you da pituma ma wedipura lengathuwa danna nisa unahasege tula mehe vimak thiyena man wenayen vinadi 10ak wedipura ara kena wenuwenta wada ayaksha karan somewhere in that isn't there selfishness etana kohe hari tanaka podi aathmarthayak thiyena nemeida it is because of my connection with him mata ohut ekka thiyena sambandhe nisa that i is there mama kiyana kena etana inno that selfishness has come in e aathmarthaya avilla the power of that prayer has already gone down e yakshave balaya etana kotama palle hata gihilla iwarai that is why we should understand prayers for others especially strangers have so much of power because it is a selfless prayer e nisa thamai ape avodha karagannone anitta wenuwen visheshen aagantuka wenuwen kara yakshava goda balagathui mokada eka parartakami yakshavak hallelujah hallelujah once i was doing a retreat in mumbai ma mumbai wala jnana kantiyak karana welawaka and it was a couples retreat eka yuval jnana kantiya and we were praying special prayers for childless couples api daruwa nathi yuval wenuwen visheshen yaksha kala and during the adoration divasa prasad aashirwade welawa i asked childless couples to stand mama e daruwa nathi yuval walta kiwa hita ganna kiya and many childless couples stood daruwa nathi godak yuval hita gatta i actually uh, asked those who are praying for the gift of a child to stand mama attarama kiwe daruwek illala daruwek ge tag illala yaksha karana ata nakidinna kiyala so many stood godak kai nakitta and we said a prayer abi yaksha wak kiwa now during that prayer dan e yaksha welawe i saw one lady was standing and after some time she sat මම දැක්ක එක කාන්තාවක් හිටගෙන ඉඳලා ටික වෙලාවකට පස්සේ ආ ඉඳගත්තා all the others continued to stand අනිත් හැමෝම දිගටම හිටගෙන හිටියා so i noticed that දැන් මම ඒක දැක්ක නිරීක්ෂණය කළා after the adoration සප්‍රසාද ආශිර්වාදයට පස්සේ they had gone for their their dinner own රාත්‍රී ආහාරයට ගියා and after the dinner when she was passing my room රාත්‍රී ආහාර ඉවර වෙලා ආයෙ මගේ කාමරය ගාවෙන යනකොට i saw her and i called her මම ඇවිද දැකලා ඇයට කතා කළා i said when we were praying and during the adoration මම කිව්ව මම කතා කළා ලැහුවා අපි සප්‍රසාද ආශිර්වාද වෙලා යක්ෂා කරනකොට i asked those who want a child to stand and you also stood දරුවෙක් කොහොන ඇය නැගිටින්න කියලා කිව්වාම ඔබත් නැගිට්ටා and i said after that i saw you sitting ඊට පස්සේ මම දැක්ක ඔබ ඉඳගෙන ඉන්නවා. Why did you sit when everyone else was standing? ඇයි ඔබ ඉඳගත්තේ අනිත් අය ඔක්කොම හිටගෙන ඉන්න කොට කියලා. And she said, "Father, I already have a child." ඇයි කිව්වා "පියතුමනි මට දැනටමත් දරුවෙක් ඉන්නවා." It's been many years now. අවුරුදු ගානක් දැන් I've been praying for a second child. මම දෙවනි දරුවා වෙනුවෙන් යක්ෂා කරන්නේ. But when we were praying, when you were saying the prayers, නමුත් ඔබ වහන්සේ ඔබ ඔබ තුමා යක්ෂාව කියනකොට, I saw all those women childless who were standing. මම දැක්ක ඒ දරුවෝ නැති ගොඩක් කාන්තාවෝ නැකිටලා ඉන්නවා. And in my heart I just told Jesus මගේ හදවතින් මම ජේසුට කිව්වා Lord don't give me another child ස්වාමිනි මට තව දරුවෙක් දෙන්න එපා let that blessing go to one of them ඒ දරුවව අයාගෙන් කනෙක්ට් දෙන්න කියලා let them get a child ඔවුන්ට දරුවෙක් දෙන්න කියලා I was so touched by that මං ඒකෙන් ගොඩක් ස්පර්ශ වුණා she didn't need to sit down ඇයට අවශ්‍යතාවයක් තිබෙ නැහැ ඉඳ ගන්න but she decided that the prayer for someone else was more important namuth ay thirane kala wena kenek wenun karana yaakshawa godak wedagat kiyala it was a selfless prayer eka parartakami yaakshawak that prayer is what makes prayer powerful e yaakshawa thama yaakshawa balagathu karanni 
praise God, two months later, she came for another retreat and she said, Father, I'm pregnant after 10 years. Hallelujah. 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 When our prayers become selfless, there is lots of power in that prayer. So I'm sure you have come here with prayers in your heart. First, have intimacy with Jesus in that prayer. And let Jesus be the power in that prayer. And then when you're praying today, pray selflessly. Open your eyes and see the pain of the other more than you see your own pain. That is what a Christian is supposed to do. A Christian opens their eyes to see the pain of the other rather than opening the eyes only to see the pain of the self. Hallelujah. 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 Today, when you are here praying for the Lord's healing, be intimate with Jesus. Jesus take a linga to win. Become one with Jesus. Let the prayers that come from your heart come from that union with Jesus. And then the Holy Spirit will open your eyes to see someone else around you who is suffering much more than you. And the Holy Spirit will inspire your heart. To offer, to offer a prayer for them. And the Lord will listen to that prayer because that prayer will become a powerful moment of healing. Because it was an unselfish prayer. Hallelujah. Pray in that way today. Pray in that way today. As we prepare ourselves all through this day for the Lord's healing touch. I don't say don't pray for yourself. You pray for yourself. You tell the Lord. If you are giving me one blessing. Give the people around me ten blessings. Especially that one who was sleeping next to me. I sat through Father Michael's boring talk without sleeping. They luckily slept all through the talk. But still, if you're giving me one, give them ten. That is a selfless prayer. Where you offer yourself for others. Hallelujah. Let us all stand. Let us close eyes. Jesus is calling us to this beautiful moment of prayer. To be one with Him. To be in union with Him. Lord Jesus, I surrender my heart. I surrender my body. I surrender my prayer. Jesus, you become one with me. I connect to you, O Lord. You connect to me, Jesus. And you inspire my heart to say a prayer. A selfless prayer for the person sitting next to me, the person sitting in front of me, the person sitting behind me. You bless them a double portion of blessing. 
ඔබ වහන්සේ දෙගුණයක් වෙච්ච ආශිර්වාදයක නොවුන ආශිර්වාද කරන්න more than you bless me and my family o oh jesus you bless them and their family මාවත් මගේ පවුලත් ආශිර්වාද කරනවට වඩා ජේසුනි ඔබ උන්වත් උන්ගේ පවුලත් ආශිර්වාද කරන්න more than you answer my prayer you answer their prayer මගේ යක්ෂාවට පිළිතුරු දෙනවට වඩා ඔබ වහන්සේ උන් වහන්සේගේ ඔවුන්ගේ යක්ෂාවට උත්තර දෙන්න lord jesus there are so many sick people around me ජේසුස් ස්වාමිනි මගේ වටේ ගොඩක් touch those sick people lord own was sparsha karanna swami heal their ailments own ge roga suwa karanna swami heal their pain own ge vedana av suwa karanna heal all the terminally ill patients darunu rogi tatvayan ge ninna hamma kenek ma suwa karanna heal all those who have maybe surgeries or operations planned shalya karmayan salasum karala tiyena ayva suwa karanna all those who are suffering jesus touch them वेदना विदिन हम किने को मजे सुने स्पर्श करा एक्सेप्ट दिस प्रेयर ऑफ माइन मगे में याक्षा मामा की आदि लेट इट बी एक्सेप्टेबल इन योर साइट ए ओबे दैस अट प्रिय मना आप करा एंड लेट इट बी अ पावरफुल मोमेंट ऑफ हीलिंग ए बालगत सोए मोहत करा हालेलुया 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 नेम ऑफ द फादर एंड ऑफ द सन एंड ऑफ द होली स्पिरिट आमेन